In an interesting development, the ICMR or the Indian Council of Medical Research has invited an expression of interest from companies who are looking to collaborate to conduct phase 3 clinical trials of vaccine candidates developed to prevent mosquito-borne viral disease dengue. Now, the applications are asked to be submitted by the 11th of March. Why is this important? Remember, this is significant because dengue is recognized to be one of the top 10 global threats in 2019. As of now, there is no specific treatment for dengue. There are vaccines approved in some parts of the world, but not currently in India. The companies have to have completed Phase 1 and Phase 2 trials successfully. ICMR will provide infrastructure to undertake further R&D activities and vaccine clinical trials to study safety, etc. The collaboration will be on a royalty basis of around 5% or above for conducting Phase 3 trials. The Drug Controller of India or the Indian Drug Regulator has given its go-ahead to Zydus Life Sciences or formerly known as Cadilla Health, its oral drug called Desidustat, branded as Oxemia TM to treat anemia associated with chronic kidney disease or CKD. Chronic kidney disease or CKD is basically a disease which impairs the function of the kidney and anemia means your body lacks a sufficient amount of red blood cells which help carry oxygen to body tissues. It is a common complication of CKD. Zydus Life Sciences drug will become the first drug in India to treat anemia in CKD patients orally. India has around 115 million patients with CKD. Currently, all the treatments are based on ESA injections, which are approved to help stimulate the growth of red blood cells in those with chronic kidney disease, HIV or undertaking chemotherapy, etc. Hence, this will be a relief to patients as this is an oral drug and expected to probably be cheaper. However, it is important to note that pricing of the drug and offtake are still to be seen.